Hi guys, what's up? Welcome back to my channel. I am doing a video that was requested. This is a hair care routine or like a hair... I guess I'm just gonna say like what products I use in my hair because honestly I don't do anything like crazy. Honestly, I love when you guys request videos. Um, I will definitely do them if you request them. I love filming everything and I just, you know, like filming what you guys like to watch as well. But yeah, so this video is all about my hair and what I do to keep it the way it is. If you didn't know, I am Hispanic, so I do have naturally like curly wavy hair. I must say my curls have gone down quite a lot because i do straighten it a lot like i wear my hair straight i want to say like 80 to 9 let's say 80 80 percent of the time i straighten my hair like my mom if you've seen her she has like ringlets in her hair and i used to have that but now that i straighten it it's just more like wavy like it's not fully curly uh, without further ado i'll just show you guys what products i use and how you know i take care of my hair <laughs> So, tip number one that I'm going to give you guys, it is do not blow dry your hair if you straighten it. Or, well, that's what I do. I always air dry my hair. So, even if that means waking up an hour earlier to just let my hair do its thing and dry a little more by itself, then that's what I'm going to do because I don't like to blow dry it and then apply more heat whether I'm straightening it or curling it. I just let it do its thing, dry, and then I will damage it myself with either a curling wand or a straightener number two this uh i discovered this i want to say like a year ish ago a year and a half ago a year ago and i have been in love ever since these are my go-to like i will not use anything else this is the body shop ginger scalp care shampoo and then the scalp care conditioner so this is what it looks like this one is running low as you can see but the Body Shop usually has a 40% off, so that's when I stock up on them because I use them so much and I know I love them. So if you guys want to try it out, the Body Shop does have 40% off, so just wait for a sale and then you can pick them up. But I love these. No, I don't have dry, like, flaky scalp, which is what this is advertised for. But I feel like I need to take care of my scalp because I do apply heat to it so much. It's not like it's going to damage your hair. If anything, it's fixing your scalp and your hair. So, like, might as well take care of it before there is a problem, you know? So, I love these. I highly, highly, highly recommend them. They have smaller ones if you guys want to try it out before purchasing the bigger one. But this is a better value, especially at 40% off. You can't go wrong. So, try these out. And these are game changers. I love them. But... When I'm in the shower and I'm using this, I do mix it sometimes with herbal essence. So when I'm in the shower, what I do is I will put conditioner. So I put a bunch of this. Like I put like a handful of this and then a bit of this. This is the herbal essence Hello Hydration Moisturizing Conditioner. So I put some of that too. I mix it together and then I put it into my ends. So I only condition from like here downwards. I don't put it up here because I don't want it to get oily. So I put it in here and what I'll do is I'll like mix it together and then kind of like create like a bun like this and then just like keep it there for a bit and then you know while I'm like shaving my legs and all of that and like soaping like putting soap on my body and everything I'll leave the conditioner in so I'll let it like soak in a little bit and then I'll just rinse it out but yeah I like just grab my hair and I just like scrunch it all like up to here. Tip number three that I have for you guys is when you are showering the last 10 seconds before you get out of the shower you're gonna put it on cold like I know it's gonna kill like at first I was like ah, I can't do this you're gonna put it on cold and I usually just like I will move my body forward so it's not in the water and have my hair like back and then just let the cold water rinse on my hair that's what I do um, it's worked there's other videos saying that it works so like I'm not crazy but it helps your hair grow and I feel like it just makes it more shiny so that's what I started doing. Um, I do try to do 15 seconds. I'm getting better at it. So I'll be like one Mississippi, two Mississippi, three Mississippi. But I won't lie. Like when it comes closer to like 10, it'll start going faster. But like try to say it. Product number four that I use, number four, yeah, tip number four, product number four is this. I don't really know what it's called. But the website is SebastianProfessional.com. So my hair stylist or where I get my hair cut uses this on me as you can see it's like super low like i need to go get another one i do have another one. i don't know where it is it's like a full size one and then this was the mini size one i take it with 
with me everywhere I go. I love it. So basically, it's just like a gel. Like, let's see. Oh, it's running low. No. Oh my god. Oh, before my camera so rudely died on me, I was showing you guys that this, you basically just, what I do is you squeeze it out. It's like a little gel thingy. So I rub it, and then again, only on my tips. Like, I'll put it like that. I'll run it through my tips. And then I'll kind of do that, like, very lightly when there's, like, no product left on my hand when I'm done, like, putting it on my tips. Just kind of rub it here. Again, I don't really like putting it at the top because I don't want it to be oily. But I love this stuff. Like, I really love it. It keeps your hair like looking so soft and hydrated and it honestly just goes like straight into your hair. But I really like how this smells. It doesn't have like a super strong like scent to it but it does help like smell good. So I really like that. And I feel like it makes it just so soft. I love it. I'm so glad my hair lady like put it in my hair and put me onto that. And I have used it ever since. As you can see I just use it. You can use it all the time. Like I put so much too. So when I straighten my hair, I tie up like half of it and I'll keep half down and I'll straighten it and I will put this in. When I'm done straightening it, I'll run it through like that and then when I get to like here, when I get like this much hair left, like this much hair, like so after all of this is straight and there's only this much, I won't put it in. Like I'll just leave it. I won't put it in like the other parts but when I'm completely done, I'll put it back here like this and then I'll just like, grab again and put some more like I use so much of this and it doesn't even make my hair oily it, like absorbs into the bottom of the hair and it just leaves it looking so shiny so I truly highly recommend that Frank so before my camera died I don't even remember what like number this was and I think it's five I want to say tip number five five is don't wash your hair every single day it's gonna dry out your hair it's not good for your hair I do not wash my hair every day I actually have a schedule so I wash my hair Mondays Thursdays and Saturdays so three out of seven days a week I will wash my hair obviously shower every day just do body showers but I do not wash my hair every day it's just gonna dry it out um, it works for me at first I did notice like I used to wash my hair every day and then I started skipping days but my hair would get really oily so at first your hair I guess is like transitioning but as it goes on I found that my hair got less and less oily so I can get away with that now but tip number six is I do like this, what is it, Batiste dry shampoo. I personally don't use dry shampoo like ever, like at all. Um, but I did have an emergency where I needed dry shampoo like not too long ago. So I checked this one out. I tried it. I really like it. This is the rose gold one. It smells so good and it works really well. So if you guys want dry shampoo I would recommend this one it's just like from your drugstore I think it was like nine ten dollars Canadian and lastly if I do keep my hair natural I don't like just leave it like that I will put in this Tresemme flawless curls boost curls and control frizz like mousse and I'll just like scrunch it into my hair but again I don't really leave my hair natural but if I do, I really like this. It really helps a lot and it keeps the hair like up and I don't know. It really, I really, really like it. So I figured I might as well recommend it for you guys if you do have like natural hair, um, natural like curly wavish hair, then try this out and let me know. It also smells really good. My top three products by far without any like doubt or anything. It is the shampoo, conditioner, and this guy. So these are my top three products that I love for my hair and that I 100% recommend like I think these guys are like they work magic so I love them again I don't know the name of this but the website I will have it in the description if I can find it so that is everything that I have to say about my hair that is what I personally do and tips that you know have worked for me I also get haircuts every like I want to say like four months yeah I get a haircut like every four to five months to trim the dead ends though nothing crazy my hair lady is amazing she knows like when I mean like cut off a little bit like she'll just cut off like she'll tell me like you need to cut off this much only like she'll do the bare minimum and then it helps my hair grow faster too 
But yeah, that is everything that I do for my hair, and that is my super simple hair care routine. Nothing crazy. I don't do any of like the hair masks or anything. Don't forget guys, if you have any video requests that you want me to film, leave them down in the description and I will check them out. But yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. Don't forget to subscribe and thumbs up the video if it helped you. I love you guys so much and I'll see you in my next one. Bye!